Uh, I started off as a high school student uh, in uh, Paul Eastwood's first year of uh, school here. I came through and I enjoyed the program, so I continued my education here. I'm working towards a degree in machine tool technology. Machine tool technology is uh, manufacturing in the industry, uh, creating things, a whole bunch of other stuff. As a machine tool technology student, I'm trying to get a, uh, a degree in the machine tool so I can go to a college in California and become a uh, professional gunsmith. I'd probably uh, remachine them, customize them, and do a whole bunch of stuff for uh, cowboy shooters and all that stuff, make their weapons more safe. Maybe get in the movie industry, yeah, that'd be cool. I really wasn't interested in machining at first, but then I saw that uh, I could take it at the high school for almost almost nothing because they gave me the scholarship. So I said, well, I'll take the class. And I came up here, and I got really interested in machine tool. Probably wouldn't be in the program without the high school program. Basically, Professor Eastwood told me us that uh, anywhere that there's manufacturing, there's always jobs available. And then I started working on our, our milling machines back there in our lathes, and it was just it really interested me, interested me at all the stuff I can do with them. Uh, what made the light go on is uh, just, I could make anything that I ever wanted to. It's like I could design and build my own car or something, and basically once, once I get all the knowledge, I can uh, start manufacturing my own stuff. In, my, in machining, you, you use your hands as, um, you know, feel your finishes on the material, uh, use your hand to crank the handles on the machines and a whole bunch of other things that you use your hands on. We do use computers. Uh, we use computers to program the machines, uh, set up um, programs to run special parts, one-off parts that you can't usually do on a standard machine. You can use it on like a computer numerically controlled machine. You program a machine, it'll run your program that you set it to. Here I've worked in the machine shop and I've also taken the computer numerical control classes, CNC, and that's given me the experience uh, to get a job out in the, uh, out in the manufacturing field, and that's what I'm doing now is working on CNC machines. What, what I like about the environment in the machine shop is, is the friendliness. Uh, everybody here is really friendly. Uh, it, it is kind of noisy in the shop, but you kind of get over it. Uh, you need to kind of have like a sense of common sense to work in a machine shop. Because uh, if you take the average Joe and throw him in front of a lathe and he doesn't know what he's doing, you know, he could crash the machine, uh, damage some stuff, possibly hurt himself. Paul's actually a very good instructor. He teaches us uh, machine safety, how to shut off the machine, how to properly operate the machines, what not to do, and, and what to do, yeah. Machining is a great field because we basically build America. Everything, every, everywhere you look around, it's all started with the machinist. Whether it's a, a mold to cast an engine block or just a simple nut and bolt. A machinist had to make a mold or make the tooling to cut it. How I got here is I took the class through uh, the, co the high school. What I'm doing here is I'm trying to get my degree in machine tool technology. And when I'm done here, I plan on going out in the workforce and uh, becoming a full-time machinist. I feel awesome about that.